Hatimaye ndani nyumba tena kutoka full respect family. Huyo hapa wewe DJ Mafi mitamboni katika picha safi sana ki Nigeria. Picha ambayo ina uwezo mkubwa kwa kusisimua ipasavyo. Utaipenda sana picha hii. Mitambo ni DJ Mafi kama kawaida katika 0769 0101 namba zetu za simu kujipatia vigongo vikali kama hivi hapa. Lakini pia unaweza kufika Mbauda sokoni. Morombo sende ice bila kusahau. Garnara Dajani katika soko la muvi. Leo tuna mzee mzima kuna binti anamuita Motola Jalade Kainde. John Okafo. Mzee mzima bwana pita ine. Na wengine wengi ambao wamefanya picha wanaita Naomi kukufikia hapo ulipo. DJ Maf mitamboni sawa sawa tenda sawa. Katika kijiji kimoja. Leo kuna bwana alikuwa ametoka mjini amekuja kuwa tembele ya wazazi. Yeah. Ilikuwa ni furaha kubwa sana. I'm happy for you. Mama anasema ni furaha sana mwanangu. Yeah. Umekuwa mkubwa eti. Huh? Wewe ni mzima anasema ndio. Oh Mungu ni mkuu kweli. Karibu sana mwanangu jamani. Oh. Ha sema rafiki yangu mama. Oh kijana karibu sana nyumbani kwetu. Nduka. Karibu ni sana jamani eh. Nduka. Nduka. So your favorites. Yeah. I'm going to prepare it. Ah, najua na njia. Hebu ngoja nikafanye maandalizi. Oh. Mwanao mkubwa kabisa wa familia anaitwa Duka. Mwisho baba naye pia alimkaribisha Duka. Kemba you want this? Thank you. Karibu sana mwanangu. Karibu sana. This is my friend. Ah, sasa baba huyu ni rafiki yangu. Bless you sir. You're welcome. Thank you sir. Yeah. Uh, I brought him home to witness the Uruji festival. Ah, uh, nasema nimemleta nyumbani. Oh, why? <laughs> Karibu sana. These are my uncles. Huyu ni mjomba wangu. Call Aaron. Anaitwa Aaron. Kolejo. Yes. Okay. You're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Karibu ni sana, karibu ni sana. Karibu ni sana. Basi, yeah, tumefurahi sana kuwaona ninyi mmekuja. Karibu ni sana. This is for you. Lakini hii pia ni zawadi. Ah, najua wazee wanapenda sana pombe, akawaletea pombe za mjini mjini. Basi baba ni yule alivangu kofia nyekundu aliyokapatia marafiki zake, ni boma moja. Yaani hapo kuna bamu dogo, bamu kubwa. Na wewe, yani tuseme boma kwa ujumla. That sucks blood. That's my ni damu bwana. Damu inachemka. Kijana anajua kabisa sasa kwa babake wanapenda nini? Okay. Hii duka karibu sana. Mm. Akamnongoneza baba kitu. Asi karibu ndani. Uh, yes. Yeah. Oh, karibu ni jamani. Hatuna sababu ya kuibariki wala ni nini pombe. Okay. Iko hapa kijana ameleta. Tunaitumia. Baba akuaga na shida. Thank you. Eh hey, sasa nyinyi endelee nikutumia. Ngoja mimi nikamsalimi mwanangu kidogo. Thank you. Asante sana. Sasa moja kati ya baba zake wadogo na Iduka. Uzo. Aliwaita vijana wake wawili hiyo. Daniel. Daniel na Uzo. Johnny hapa ni nyota wawili. Yana watoto wawili vijana wake wawili. Na yule ni kakake mkubwa na mtoto mmoja tu wa kiume. Mzee amechukia. Kuna kitu hajapenda. I am disappointed that uh, both of you have not been able to notice what is. Unajua sipendezo na ninyi kwamba hakuna kitu chochote mnachokifanya. You are asking me. Kwa nini baba? Mnaniuliza mimi? Every year Duka is either building a new house. To... Kila mwaka Duka akija na jenga nyumba mpya hapa kijijini. And you are asking me what is. Na nyinyi mnaniuliza nini shida? Why we sell off our lands? to survive. Mtu kabai is new plots of land. Sisi wakati tunapouza viwanja wetu tuweze kuishi, idukana ananunua viwanja na kujenga nyumba. Is he the only person that has that kind of money in this our country? Is he more hard working than the rest of you? Sasa ninyi mmekaa tu, mmeridhika. Huh? Many persons has he been able to train in that in business. Nobody. Hakuna mtu anayekaa hapa akifikiri kwamba atafanya biashara gani? Awe kama iduka. Ah, mmekaa tu bakwiki lazima mfikiri na ninyi kama wanangu that boy is a thief that's what kijana ni muizi baba what about osondo vipi kuhusu osondo kama yeye ni muizi osondo na ni muizi mbona osondo anafanikiwa mimi nafikiri ninyi ni wapuuzi wa akili hamjui kufikiri hamjui jinsi ya kutafuta pesa hamjui jinsi ya kufanya mambo yende papa babaye what exactly are you driving at sasa unataka si tufanye nini anaambia hiyo ndio point sogeni ndo gas money by medicine nafikiri pesa za iduka ndo mnaweza mkazitumia hizo hizo pesa mkatoka kimaisha na nyie try what you can you will remember fanyeni mwezavo kufanya 
ili mradi mpate kuwa karibu na ye ni mtu mwenye mafanikio ni mtu mwenye pesa anaweza kuwasaidia ninyi mkatoka kimaisha so mnakaa tu hapo kijijini mna mnapauka tu uso mnapata magamba kipumbavu hamtafuti pesa alafu mnasema umezeo ni mchawi au muizi hakuna muizi hapa kama ni kweli baba Cha msingi ni kuungana naye. Baba anasema ndo mawazo hayo. Now beginning to understand. Sasa nafikiri sasa mmeanza kunielewa na maanisha nini baba yenu? itawezekanaje? It is his father. Kwa kupitia baba yake mnaweza mkapata nafasi. Babake mimi ni mdogo wake. Eh? Ananisikiliza? Nikimwambia hata kuwa na shida duka lazima atachukua ninyi na mtakwenda mjini, maisha atakwenda kuwa safi kule. Huko ndiko mahali watu wanakuanzia maisha. So mnakaa tu kijijini hapa. What? Papa, I thought we should be avoiding him instead. Yeah, no way. Listen, excuse me. Now that you know the medicine, that his medicine will have no effect on you. Tatizo ni kitu kinachoathiri ninyi ni mawazo. Mawazo mabaya. Ndio anaoathiri ninyi yeye kwamba nyie mnafikiri kwamba hii duka peke yake ndio ana uwezo kupata mafanikio au hii duka peke yake tu sijui ni mchawi hakuna kitu kama hicho mafanikio ni kujitoa kwenu nyie pia you are teaching in a commercial school kona nifundisha mimi baba yako anakuelekeza hivi wewe unasema hivi how many people build houses these days kwani ni watu wangapi kwenye hichi kijiji wanafanya vitu vikubwa vinafurahisha kwa macho mfikiri na nyie kwamba wao wanatumia kile gani basi baba aliwashauri na alichukua hatua kuwasaidia. Kwa kuwa ni boma moja ili. Thank you. Stop that. Baba yao baba yake na duka sasa aliwaita vijana kwa pamoja na akajaribu kumuongelesha au kumuomba kijana wake iduka kusobari ya wadogo zake kwa pande wa ndugu yake mdogo. Daniel Johnson. Daniel pamoja na uso. It is standard amount to put two hands in her mouth at the same time. Mwisho hii duka alielewa kwa baba uko sawa. I think I can cope. Nafikiri naweza kwenda na mama na mzuia. <laughs> mama hataki. Established new joto na kina mama hataki. Lakini anasema ina shida ni wadogo zangu hawa. Especially now I'm moving into manufacturing. Tawapeleka mjini. Ejo for you have had him? Yeah. Mefrai eh, lazima ndio. As a house big enough. Eh. Hey. Nyumba yetu ni kubwa bwana. Sisi lazima tusaidiane sisi kwa sisi. Lazima tuinuane vijana wa nyumbani bwana. Eh? Lazima pia tuwatengeneze watoto wetu kukaa katika hali ya kushirikiana na kusaidiana. Thank you. <laughs> Walishukuru sana. Thank you. Asante. Lakini mama mzazi akupendezwa na hili swala. La idu kakukubali kuwasaidia wa ndugu zake upande wa baba mdogo. And they work very hard. Lakini cha msingi aliwakumbusha cha kufanya si kwamba mjini ndio kuna mafanikio. Kuna mafanikio ndio lakini pamoja na hayo kuna umuhimu mkubwa sana ninyi kufanya kazi kwa bidii sana. Uh, uh, if I may ask, labda nikauliza swali. Are you going to bring a wife? Because that is the only debt you are going to us. Eh, hey, lini utakwenda kuleta mke maana hili ndio jambo la msingi sana ambalo sisi tunatamani kulijua. Very very soon. Anasema muda si mrefu, taleta mke. Mama nearly beat me up. Mama ile swala alishaniuliza toka jana kwamba natamani kuona mjukuu. Sasa ili jambo la mke mtalifanya mapema na upesi. Hilo lisiwasumbue. Mm. Presently she's doing her youth service in Kano State. Kwa sasa na mchumba huu. Of course na mchumba na andela na shughuli zake za kawaida. <laughs> Kwa hivyo muda si mrefu tu mtapata pamwine. <laughs> yaani pamwine ili pombe hapo bushi. Eh hey, kinywa sasa kuna tukio lazima litatendeka hapo. Len <laughs> Kweli mambo yalikwenda safi. Na mheshimiwa aliamua kuachukua ndugu zake. Na leo ilikuwa ni siku ya kwenda mjini. Usemi watu wengi husema kwamba kufanya kazi na ndugu ni kazi kubwa sana. Bora mkatie fungu ndugu akatafuta maisha yake mbele kwa mbele lakini kuishirikiana kwenye shughuli. Siku zote kuna lawama nyingi sana. Sasa hebu tuone itakuwaje. Ameamua kujitoa na kuwasaidia hawa watoto wa babaki mdogo. Safari ilianza hatimaye wanakwenda mjini. 
Picha unaita Naomi. Ni picha moja nzuri sana utaipenda. Kweli masiku kadhaa baadaye alipita na idu kali amoa kwa mke. Uso pamoja na Daniel pia walikuwa wamekushafika mjini. Na jamani mchapakazi kweli aliwakabidhi baadhi ya sehemu za kusimamia katika miongoni biashara zake. Na sasa mke wake ni mjamzito, karibu atajifungua. Ni muda mrefu mkushapita. Hi there. Hi darling. Yes. Hi there. Um, uzo. Uzo. I established this new branch so that my Nimejaribu kuongeza branch za kutosha. Unfortunately, it has not been so. Nafikiri hakuna kitakachokuwa tofauti sasa kwa sababu after month the story is the same. Nafikiri kuna shida fulani katika utendaji wenu wa kazi nikifuata report. Kwa sababu nikiangalia report kila mwezi report ni ile ile. Knows well. Haibadilike iongezeke ipungue unajua tu haizekani miezi mitatu miwili report za utendaji wa kazi zikao zinafanana published the same electronics business in that same shopping mall at the same time bwana mkubwa anashangaa kidogo kuna shida from the proceeds of work. sasa nafikiri kutakuwa kuna shida katika utendaji wenu wa kazi another shop kutakuwa na shida my two shops sasa na mashaka na ninyi na mashaka na ninyi shops could not fetch me haiwezekani duka maduka yangu toka nimefungua yasionyeshe maendeleo kubadilika kila siku biashara ile sasa mama akasema lakini sivyo taking is totally wrong waste to waste your mambo huwa yanakwenda hivyo proper accounting can only be done with your purchasing receipts and your sales invoice Otherwise, your boys are going to be stealing money from you people without you knowing. Our boys. Tena wifi heshimejeo alijaribu kuwakumbusha kwamba lazima wafanye kazi katika mpango kwa sababu sometimes huenda wale vijana wadogo ambao wamewakabidhi kufanya kazi wanaweza kuchukua pesa passport kufahamu. Ikawaletea ninyi shida kwa kaka yenu. Kwa hiyo ni pia kwa kama sikilizeni. You can see this afikiri nimesha ona. Honey, that's what I st- Haya naye afanye ni kwa ajili yangu mimi na mke wangu na mwanangu atakaye zaliwa. Sasa mbona unaambia unaongea tena mbele na ah lazima niseme kwamba sio wakafikiri mali hizi ni zao. Hiyo ni wakati wao kutafuta za kwao kupitia mimi. Kwa afanye kazi kwa bidii. Sitaki li jambo lijirudie tena. Sawa uso na na Daniel. Look, if you do this faithfully I am very sure she will even help you improve on your Eh kama mtu afanye ili jambo vizuri Sitapenda mnilaumu kwa lolote maana nimefanya kwa nafasi yangu. Okay. <coughs> Brother afu yuko wazi yani anaga mambo hapo naweza kwenda. Huyo okay. ndo mke wake na jamaa ndo anamuita Naomi na ndo mbeba jina la picha. Kwa nini akabeba jina la picha bibi ya Naomi? Okay. Si wakubali sana wa vijana na mashaka ni ndugu zangu lakini na mashaka nao sana. Okay. No way. Aliwaonya tu kwa sababu anataka kuona wakibadilika. Sasa zilivotoka pale. Now this woman is making things difficult. So. Asiye mwanamke anaziri kufanya mambo tofauti ya seja mwangu bana. Oh, I count. Hata tusema, afu sikutenda na mshauri kaka hata kutusema sema vibaya yani. Uishe uishe meji si huyu. Forgetting that it is curiosity that landed a bullet on the forehead of the monkey. So what are we going to do? Kwa... Sasa tutafanya nini kwa wakati huu? Do not count her. Mm-hmm kuweka mambo safi and, and there is absolutely no way we can deceive her maana kuna njia nyingine ambayo tutaweza kujisaidia kwa sababu kama itakuwa ni masuala hayo ni rais gundulika wizi tunaofanya mara kwa mara we are around in the shop on monitors you tunachokiona ni kwamba huyu shemeji ndo ana kirere na amekuwa mara zote akizunguka katika maduka yetu na ndiye analeta ripoti kwa kaka kwa mume wake sasa ngoja Tutajua cha kufanya tu ili mradi si tupate mfanikio. Kwa ini kwa kifupi ndio hivyo kwamba hawa jamaa wamekabidhiwa branch mbalimbali wasimamie za kaka yao. Lakini ni wazi. Hope you want papa not to discuss to anyone that we put. Sasa hakikisha baba asipate jambo hili lolote. Walas. 
Mba bwana si tunachatakia ufanya tukienda kule kijijina sisi Tuangushe mijengo ya kufa mtu So kila siku tunawonekane si tuwafanya kazi wake tu Kwa hata wazazi kule hawajui chochote kinachoendelea kwa hawa ndugu huku Lakini hawa ndugu wa wili wa baba mmoja Plani nizao ni kupata fedha kwa haraka zaidi Na kufanya zaidi kwa hawa nataka kumuibia ndugu yao Haya Hazi kupita siku nyingi sana Leo Bibie Naomi alipata uchungwa kujifungua Aliesi uchungwa kujifungua Chasa tatibu za kuwaisho hospitali Kwa jili ya mpango mingine Shino dinomba Kone Pige pige simu Mwite mze Mwambe mambo siyo Timo de komo Hey Fanya raka eti Mwwe la tola shiseme kikwa nana Mwwe sema uje ya raka jamani Abe kum 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 Fanya raka uje Bidi fon Abe kula ma do kula ma Anakuja anakuja Is he coming? Yeah Anakuja anakuja Ok Ok Tasubiri Uwi Hey Anakuja Sorry Kafanya kazi ni kafupi kana mpepea pepea mama Mama anasikia kila mali joto Yo shuli seo pevu So mchezo ni shuli pevu yo Vasa taivo gari ikawa ni meleto wa rakaraka Na ukweli jamali kwa ofisi ni fasta na kuje tare kumawesha mkewe ya hospitali Bibio wana muita omotola JD Hani Pole jamani Nipeleke Nipeleke na sikia hali ni mbae Pole 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 Where is Ngozi now? Ngozi uko hapi? Fanya raka leta hivyo vivu mfuko Mfuko makaroko shabaka ya rashagara Yes Before the daktari Ok Do mpango mzima tu Spencer nasema imeandikwa Watazako uchungu so ye ya Wakina dada Spencer kasema so mimi Kweli mungu ni muema siku zote Na siku ilipofika Naomi alijipatia mtoto wake salama Na alipotoka ndani wakwe zake wale kuja kuja kumtembelea Vipi hali ya safari mama wako na shida kabisa Nime kuja kumuona wajina Nime fray sana This is my grandson Anasema ndo mjuku wangu he Wa kiume God you are wonderful he Mungu ni mwema jamani. So I can witness my grandson eh? Kwa hatimaye nimemshuhudia mjukuu wangu wa kiume. Eh? Ege nye maboro mangwa. Oye ege. Nikapigwa mzee la kinyumbani nyumbani. Huku George. Oye ege nye mu handbag. Oye ege nye mu. Ndu kama iso. Ndu kama mwanangu. Ongera sana mwanangu. Vasante mama. God is good. Mungu ni mwema. Oye. No. Hey. Daniel. Nanyie. Daniel. Uso. Do menene pa hivi? Fertilize au. Uzo uzo. Uzo uzo. Karibu. That's no problem. You wanna find my dear. You're welcome eh. Uzo. Bring those food. Uzo. The food. The food. Leta leta msosi. Oh go no go. Ka be good. Jesus and he's a girl. Basi ilikuwa ni fra kubwa mna Mata wukom leta Anafanana iti msema anafanana nani Mama Mama Did you remember to tell Uncle James Unakumbuka 
kumwa ulikumbuka kumwambia Uncle James anaba ndio nimemwambia kila mtu kuna mtu ambaye ajui kule kijijini mama yeye tayari mnaye mtoto cola not food <laughs> anything you want to hey, uh... everybody was so happy <laughs> kila mtu amesikizi habari aliyesikizi habari hakika mm. amefurahi sana Zimekone bari nzi njema mno I want to ask you Okay Wajani kulizi Look at this baby Hei muangale mtoto Tuo zingu kwa Hei muangale anafana na nani We've started it Mama uspendele No mama Mama kuali sema anafana na nani Mbaba haki o mama haki We've started this again No mama kwa siwa Tuo muangale Who does it look like He looks like your father in law man Anafana na baba mko haka Mama kawana siwapendele My husband Kawanyanga ya nafana na mme wangu Hala sasa mnataka ni seme fana na nani Oh my dear Ayo ya lipita Mana siku wa zigandi wanasema swaili Kila siku mambo mapia Furai na kuja watu na furai Wana isawi li furai Wana kutana mengine ya napita Siku moja usiku bibie na umi ya kiwa na mume wa milala kitandani Aliota ndoto ya kutisha mna Mwame wake ya kamuliza kuna shida gani? Arasama ni kuso baya ya ndoto mbaya Ndoto mbaya Inausu nini? Arasama pana Ni kukusu wewe What about me? Kusu mimi? Vipi kusu mimi? I just... I just dreamed that we were attacked savagely by two masked men. Ni mauto mevamio na watu wa wili. Come on. Sijali, baby. Now where you're crying. Mambo ni saolala tu sijali. Izo ni notombaya izo. The body dream. Nothing is gonna happen to you. Hakuna chuchote kitatokea kusu mimi. Not to me. Kwa angu, kusu mtoto, ata yupia. Takuwa salama. Se, kamukagua mwana yuko safi mtoto milala tuwa mnashida. Ndoto. Ndoto ni maono mbayo. Kajua, zamani watu wa zamani mungu walikuwa na simaneo live tuko sapia wakuwa na mambo mengi sana. Chana pilika pilika nyingi sasa mungu wata kuambia nini Kwa wana time sao milala usiku basa na kuambia na kudokeza mambo Inakuwaga hivi marazote Sasa usio na zarao mara nyingi ndo tuwa zina maana kubwa sana Ok Asubui siku defuata Toto na mwaga baba hake Mzea likuwa na safari Mfanya biyashara na fanya biyashara nyingi nyingi tuwa pa mjini Na maduka mengi ya kuza vifava umeme na vitu mbali mbali Arasama ni kijana mwenye nguvu sana he Kama babake vile ane I really wish you are interested at this time Sikuwa na pendezo kwa kusafiri chikipindi miongu If I don't, the factory cannot take off Wanajua nini, nisipo safiri mkiongu Kiwanda kitenda vema Kwa lazima nisafiri mambo hende safi I call you once I get out Nita kupigia kila mara kila saa Nita kapo kwa safarini Utesikia sauti yangu Boy. Eh. Boy. Look, take care of your mother. Kijana. Sorry. Mwangale mama ako, kuta shida tu minaanza na we. Ete na mwache magizo mtoto mlinde mama ake na maminia. Basi, biyashara zote zikawa chini ya mkewe, bibi ya Naomi. Bwana mkuba misafiri, itamgari mmuda. Daniel. Mwaneta ripote za kazi. On July. Hii ni kwanzi ya July, report ya July I hope things have improved this Nafikiri mambo sasa meendelea zaidi sasa hivi Ndiyo, kagua tu Alright, I'll read it and I'll let you do Ok, ina shida ni tasoma tu Ok Tasoma, nitapitia Bye Tarifa za kazi Documenti zile mama nasema tazipitia tu Hakuwa na haraka sana Kwanza na wapenda mashimiji za kafu pia na waamini Sasa, hakaone mgoja nipitia kwanza Alikuta dokumenti mbili tofauti Confidentially Sasa kumbi Kuna plani zilikozi kendelea za siri 
akakuta akakuta receipt nyingi fake ambazo huwa anazitumia akajua kumbe hizi hii ndio plan au ndio mbinu ambayo mara nyingi wanaitumia uso pamoja na mwenzake hasa Daniel mikataba mbalimbali feki kati ya ufanye bia yani kuziana vitu receipt fake na vitu vingine vingi kwamba pesa kutoa receipt fake maana yake zile pesa zinaingia kwao kuna vitu wanauza alafu hawaweki kumbukumbu zile pesa wanakula wao akao migundua sasa live jinsi ambavyo hawa washemeji zake au au ushemeji yake mmoja anavuiba na maana sio anashirikiana maana kwa ujumla ni wote akaona hapana aseme kitu akatunza vizuri Achele OG pale ile fake akaenda kuificha kwamba mume wake atakapokuja basi atamuonyesha kama vidhibitisho kwamba hawa maheshimiji zake basi so aminifu Sasa wakati wa Daniel akiwa njiani huko jamaa yake huko uso wanamsubiria ya kipindi brother yuko ndo kipindi kizuri cha kupiga bingo. Ah the traffic. Mambo yako safi nimechelewa tu kwa ajili ya jam traffic. Yeah, uh, kila kitu kiko safi sasa hapa. Tunaweza tukajikuta tunajipatia pesa ndefu tu. What is this? Nini tena hii? Sasa kumbe zile document alikosea. Monthly account. Let me this man. Ah. Nimesahau ni nim. Akampa lile dili lao alafu zile dokumenti zingine ambazo hazina maana wakabaki nazo. Ile file unataka lenye zile receipt fake. Ala. He. Anakuja kugundua ile haraka haraka ile pressure pressure off nini? Akao akatoa ile akaona Mungu wangu. Talk to me what is that? Niambie nini kimetokea? Uzo 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 uzo. Also I think I mistakenly gave madam Nafikiri nimefanya mistake nimempa madam ile What are you talking about Unaongea kusini na nimempa madam Cheese Siri imevuja Sasa How how did it happen Sasa imekuaje As I was coming out this morning Nimekuja pale asubuhi What was she doing when you you, you, you... Sasa ulimpaje She was reading she was drinking Oh only cost you me She may not have opened the Tunde na karaka bana tukaangalie. Oh. Maki sasa kama itakuwa migundulika hii ikifika kwa brother ni kwamba watafukuzwa kazi mazima maana hawa jamani matapeli. Wamefika mbali kinyama. Kwamba sasa wamefika mahali wanagawana nusu kwa nusu na mwenye duka. Ya maana jikuta tu akiwafanyia watu kazi afu ni ndugu zake. Hatari kweli kweli kufanya kazi na ndugu nataka moyo. Sasa nataka kucheki Mungu asaidie tu wakute. Hajafanya chochote. Fungua geti haraka wewe vipi? Sogea. Sasa kaja kwa mnyato wa hatari hatari. kuta kajuda atakuwa jaona katoka pap lakini kila kitu alikishajua yule madada mwanadada wanamuita Naomi jamaa karudi na tabasamu kama da hatojagundulika ucheki 
wanakuta jarara tu. Oh shit, document za ndani zote mama amechukua na maana kashajua. Tete. Tutafute njia nyingine sasa another plan. Bibie Naomi aliwaza na kuwazua. Kwa nini na wana, wana mpango gani? Mbona wanapendwa, wanapewa kila kitu? Tena mume wake amejaribu kuwapa nafasi ya kwanza katika maisha. Jali sana. Hapa kazi. Eh. Uso pamoja na Daniel Ilibido tafta na fasa sa wakai Wafanyi nini kwa sababu hili jambo likifika kwa kaka yao Itakuwa ni mbaya zaidi Dan you have finished me <laughs> Daniel minimaliza Why did you have to make such a stupid and expensive mistake Utisaji kufanya mistake kipuzi na mnaiwo Why did you have to take that file hmm? in the first place I took... Kwanu usingi liweke le file katika na fasa ya kwanza sema Makini sema mbo Sign That is it now Sasa Nili changanyikiwa yetu jama angu Siku jueli kama ligeza kutokea Dan you have finished me Oh misabisha ni me Uminimaliza Daniel All the things that we have worked for You have destroyed all Wakati otu nafanya kazi yote kama ilazima uwe makini All of it Throw it down the drain This woman has always been suspicious Sasa umana mki lazima tasabisha tusumamishwe kazi Ya ulo lote leza tokia kwetu Chuchote kibaki leza kutokia kwetu All this we rented Receipt of the cars we bought. Oh, kila kitu licho nacho tutanyanganyu. Na amna tulicho kifanya mpaka sevi cha maana mbacho tatu kifukuzo kazi tunacha kusema tumefanya. You have killed me. Uwe. Uzo. Uzo. I'm sorry. Sorry. Naombo niwe rathi. Can't you see that what papa would say in three years ago? Sijajua, lakini kumbuwe kele mbacho baba alisema miaka mingi, miaka michache lopita siku tutupakuja mjini. Lazima tufanya mbino yoto tufanikiwe. Thank you. Let us stop lamenting over this. Ebu, tuwazi njia pili, tusibaki hapa tu. Tuwazi utafanya nini ili kueza kutoko kunyili tatizo. Of what use will that be? She has seen the documents. Kasha ona document. Nini tutafanya? We burn them. Kasha ona document, uwezi wetu wote wako wazi? It's to stop her from telling Nduka about it. Cha kufanya ni kumzui asimweleze Nduka chochote. Kivipi? Ha? Ni kumua? Kumua? Unafikiri tutafanya njia gani tofauti na kuwa? Imagine you going back to the village disgrace that. Fikiria kama ukirudi leo kijijini katika hali kama hii. Ujajenga ifi. Kijiji kizima kitakucheka. Na kwenda kwetu kwa madaa na magari na mavumbi tunafanya kazi kwa iduka mambo mazuri. Fikiria. Uzo, how do you do this? Kaisaje kuwa mtu, huh? Eh. One million people before. Uzo, please now what? What is that? Let's get out of here first. Em tondo ke kwanza apa. This is risk for survival. In injia pekia kufa ku survive. We must come up with some idea. Eh, lazima tu fanya kitu tu ezo ku survive. We VIP we. Le. Tu wazi chaku fanya ni kuwa uzo kuwa. Daniel aliwaza kona yego shuli kwe. Uzo meto wazo Shimeji ya wawe Musiku If we don't strike this night We have missed it Yen tukipoteza usiku wale watu jamu uwa Tumepoteza kila kitu Umana kesho iduka na kuja na akija ishu iduka tumekuisha Uso Uso I agree with you But the question
question now this how to do it nimekubaliana na wewe lakini swali ni kwamba tutafanyaje hmm? and so forget how we pillow something uso ah. ah. uso mimi na mashaka jamaa wangu eti get please can you still nail so rais eti kuwa mtu so rais ah. and nobody will know she is dead tutaizaje kumua na mtu atazijua jafa lakini kuna watu nawafahamu tukawape taarifa ionekane kama vile ni majambazo yamevamia hapo akamua let us take her alafu tukishamaliza tutum tupo mbali where would you tell the police tutaeleza nini polisi that time of the night mm. watu wavamia usiku je yeah, sisi tutakuwaape wakati watu wanavamia mbona tusiwaoe sisi Mungu wangu hii naye kali sasa heuwi Wiki. lakini subiri just a minute nipe dakika moja do you know kennedy unamjua kennedy 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 yes yeah 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 his bachelor's if is to know jamani bachelor wa tari now look at this sasangalia we will tell the kid man we are going for the pe tutacheza game la kumtoa lolote litakalo tokea litokee nje hapa Yaani ionekane kombe ile tukio likufanyikia hapa. Ili polisi watakapoanza upelele siku nifuata. Ngoja. Uh, Zitaliba. <coughs> uko kote Taliba. Uko. Polisi wakigundua ili swala watagundua likufanyikia hapa lilitokea nje hapa. Wait, wait. Em subiri kwanza. Yeah. Wataalamu wanapanga plani hapo ya kutenda dhambi. Hivi ndivyo unavyokuwa katika nyumba nyingi tu haya mambo huwezi kuyajua maana pengine ushiriki. Sasa inakuaga hivi watu wanapanga plani za kijambazi. Sikia tu nyumba jirani zimelia hapo mtu fulani kadedi unachukulia amekufa tu lakini usijue ya kwamba pengine nini kilisababisha kifo chake. Maskini Naomi asijue chochote usiku wa siku hiyo. Akakauka kama vile hakuna ajajua chochote anamsubiri mume waje. Bwana yesu biko. Ah amka. Madam. Hey madam. I just want to let you know that Tanner and I will be attending a friends bachelor's eve tonight. Nilitaka tukufahamishe toko mimi na Daniel usiku leo tuna mahali tunakwenda. Okay, uh, but have you told Mahmoud about us? Okay, please make sure. Lakini msisahau kumweleza mfungu wa geti. Ili kama mtachelewa kurudi baadaye asiache kuwafungulia geti. Drive on. Na amue makini mnapoendesha gari njiani usiku si mnajua. Ambaye mna shida shemejitajitahidi sana katika hilo. Okay. Sasa Naomi ni jambo ajechukulia zito sana. Alichukulia jepesi na akaona anaweza akafanya tu kitu. Na mashemeji zake. Lakini kumbe wenzake umechukulia katika mapana marefu zaidi. Na umefikia tu kutaka kumuua. Masikini ya Mungu Naomi. Ngazi. Mimi baby. Ngozi mleta mtoto. Kuna hii folda. Mhm. Thank you. Good night, eh? Go sleep. Ngozi anasikia sikia usingizi. Akaambua kalale zake bwana. Shoti ngozi. Ni shoti kweli. Mama bado endelea kucheki nulinga taratibu. Muda ulipofika alikuwa na kitandani kulala. Lakini kumbe washemeji zake wametoka lengo silo. Lengo ni kumrudia tena kwa kumteka nyara. bembeleza mtoto wake vizuri hatimaye mtoto akalala akampele kwenye kitanda chake akamlaza vizuri ili naye aweze kupata usingizi wa usiku bibi Naomi
lakini basi usiku mama nasikia mlango na gongwa nani mimi uzo uzo yes, ndio madam come the door is not locked mlango hujafungwa ingia tu madam madam uzo you didn't go to the bee any uzo hujaenda tena huko uko nataka kwenda problem so uh, kuna shida ndogo nani Se. nini wakamkamata mzee piga kamba daniel na uzo maskini katoto ni kadogo tuka pale Mama kazibo mdomo vizuri kabisa wakampiga kamba. Mashemeji yao. Maskini hakujua yangelikuwa makubwa hivi. Siku kwa usiku mzee. Katoto kameachwa pale. Mwecheki Ramani kwanza za mlinzi. Maki mlinzi ndio shahidi wa pekee ambaye anaweza kuwaletea shida baadaye. Asijua hapo mlinzi walifanya nini maana waliaga wanaondoka. Kumbe wa kuondoka walikuwa bado wako ndani. Na information kati ya mlinzi pamoja na mama zita kuisha tu kwa sababu muhusika alitaka kujua habari zao ndo huyo aliyomteka Cheki mlinzi amezuba maskini bibi naome anachukuliwa kaingizo kwenye buti ya gari hivyo hivyo Mtoto wake ndo huyo ni mdogo tu ana miezi kama mitatu hivi maskini toka amezaliwa mitatu minne mambo ameenda hivyo kwamba aliaga na kwenda kulala na mfanyakazi ule wa kike ambaye ni ngozi naye alienda kulala kwa hakuna najua taarifa mlinzi anachokumbuka ni kwamba hawatu waliaga kwamba watotoka watenda kwenye pati kwa sasa ndo wanatoka kwenda kwenye pati kumbe wanatoka kati wamembeba muhusika kwenye nyumba kwa paka hapo umetengeneza game ambayo itakuwa ni vigumu sana polisi kujua azeoga Fungua geti bana. Tunaenda kwenye pati. Kwenye pati eh, tunaenda kwenye pati. Pati, pati. Pati ni nini? Kumbwa fungua geti pati. Jinga nini? Haya. Daniel na uzo umeenda kwenye pati, madam alikwenda ndani kulala akapotelea kitanda ndo taarifa za uongo zinavyotengenezwa sasa wanamtoa kwenda kufanyiwa wanavyotaka huko kwa hapo sasa yuko mikononi mwao hakuna atakayeweza kuuliza swali haya huyo ndo mwanadamu utafanya kila kitu pate kumridhisha kile bado atalia tu tamlamba mpaka visigino lakini bado shukurani hata kuwa nayo na mwisho wa siku yule unayeona kwamba unaweza kumfanyia mema zaidi na zaidi na zaidi ndo huyo anaitumika kukuumiza siku moja leto kwa nyambi si nyame ra jamaa anamuitaga Kennedy ana sura moja chafu kinyama kisura ya kiroba jogo if you dare make any sound <laughs> ai rambo mimi naitwa rambo kennedy so <laughs> crush you over and over again hey, na kuondoa tena na tena kipiga kelele inazama hii koka kimya kama ni msiniue funga mdomo daniel daniel then why i don't deserve this sasa nini nimekosea oh my baby mwanangu jamani those documents 
zile documents documents in the secret file zile document na secret file ulizozichukua is that what all this is about sasa chindo hiyo ndo sababu kutaka kuniua what am i doing with them anyway the question funga mdomo maswali mengi ya nini it's in my drawer by the bed arasema zile document ziko kitana ni kwangu kwenye drawer ya kitana changu but i can't believe my usiamini mashemeji zangu ni wapendao mnaweza mnaweza kunifanyia hivi uzo uzo we have gone wrong ni kipi kibali kilichokifanya kuziona tu hizo document kwani si mgeniambia obstacle ulifanya mistake kubwa sana kubwa mno ultimate aim is to eliminate that your arrogant husband he took over everything sisi mpango wetu ni huu tunataka kumiliki mali zote za mme wako mwisho wa siku tumfanye kuwa masikini na si tumiliki kila kitu ndio mpango toleo nao kama ulikuwa ujui monkey tena unaweza kuwa sababu kubwa sana kufanya si tusifikie malengo kwa hata kufoka kwa leo si juu so document tu rambo subiri van rambo napoteza time rambo do the deal fanya deal ikato lokubaliana alafu anasepa please 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 don't kill me. Na kombo siniwe. Please. Rambo ana ukweli. Na kuomba. Na mtoto mdogo jamani. Ana miezi minne tu. Do you have a child? Wewe unaga mtoto? Do you are you married? Ujaoa? Please. 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 I'll give you anything you want. Eh? Nitakupa chochote tunachokitaka. Lakini naomba usiniwe. You have absolutely nothing. Una chochote ambacho unaweza kunipa. Be in your next life. Labda maisha yako tu. And I'm hired to do a job. Sasa mimi naifanya kazi yangu maana mimi so msaliti huwa ni mtenda kazi mahiri. Goodbye, pigwa kisu. Pigwa za kutosha. Alimaliza kibarua. Mzee mzima anamuita Rambo. Mtoto mdogo huyu wa miezi mitatu atakwenda wapi? Unaweza kuua mwili wangu lakini hutaweza kuiwa nafsi yangu. Alipokufa katika mwili nafsi ilitoka. Na walipondoka shemeji zake aliwaona. Anajishangaa tu kwamba mbona nafsi imetoka mara mbili. Kitu cha ajabu sana. Akaanza kuifuata gari nyuma. Keep sharing and Basi hiyo ni sehemu ya kwanza katika picha ni Tanahumi. Lakini ninayo sehemu ya pili. Ya picha hii hapa. Atende sambamba. Nini kinakwenda kutokea? Ha? Naomi amekufa alafu inakuaje hivyo hivyo? Ha? Hiyo ni sehemu ya kwanza lakini kabla mtupate kitu tusonge mbele. Hawa watu wanajiita love ni hope. Katika huduma bora za kupamba harusi sherehe yoyote ile ambayo inahitaji kupambwa ikapendeza. Unaweza kuwatafuta watu katika 0767 17 37 52 0767 17 37 52 ama 0764 65745 wanapatikana hapa Arusha mjini. Kwa huduma bora za kupamba maharusi, kupata chochote kinachohusiana na masuala ya sherehe sherehe, kio ni kupamba sahani, bakuli, vyombo vya music na vitu vingine. Wana connection safi tarumbeta na vinginevyo. Wapigie tu. Mama atakwenda safi na madalali wa ukweli afi pia ndio kazi yao kupamba na kupendezesha harusi. Asante sana. Tunaunganisha sehemu ya pili katika kitu na kitu Naomi. Yeah, pa.